Oh. Didn't even know that existed. Thank you, Auto Lock Technology. But yeah, Athena, you are the one that called me into service. As you're the one who told me to kill Ares. You are the one who sent the... You are the one that made me the god of war in Ares' place. You are the one that sent me... Uh, sent me the Colossus to kill. Because like, oh, I don't like you anymore. You are the one that started this. Not me. Specific requires sacrifice by fire. Screw you, lady. When are you actually going to get stunned? You weren't in the right goddamn place. No. I gotta run and burn her. Burn, baby. That's only like a third of the way. Better reach her. Yay. Yay, lady. Now you get to burn like your friends. Well, only 200. I thought it was 2,000. Oh, well. Well, time to step into the blood. That's not creepy at all. I wonder if they regret giving me so many tools, like Poseidon's trident, to breathe underwater. Is this the river, river Styx? Or like a part of it? What the hell is this? Well, I mean, that's the, uh... That's the God of War symbol.
All right. Ah, dang it. Wrong size. There we go. And now, let's see if something will happen when I pull the lever. Pull the lever, crunk! I don't know what to do with you. There must be a way I can push you into the hole. Where is the hole? Where is the hole? I don't think there is one. purpose to anything. There's no easy, just mess around, find the answer thing. Blag. Oh, well that certainly was made obvious. Fuck you, game. Just fuck you, game. You can't do that. That's so stupid. Now the answer is obviously gonna be up here somewhere. Bliggy 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 blue. Just go around, knock off all the stalactites, I guess. God damn, why? They didn't make. Once again, why is it the insipidly obvious things? are made even more obvious with them making them glow and zoom the camera in on it. But stuff like this, they don't give a single damn. The incredibly stupid, obvious shit. We have to make stupid hard. No, like the obvious shit. We just like, okay, we're just gonna, what the fuck? But the obvious stuff, they don't care. Oh, yeah, sure. We're just gonna zoom in. Like, I think I am so in enraged by this game's stupidity that I can't even talk correctly. What I mean to say is, the obvious things are given too much attention. Like, oh, hey, this big thing that is obvious is totally here. And just like bleg, 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 bleg. They gotta zoom in, make them shine. Even the stupid obvious things where it's like, okay, you did a thing. And the obvious thing is just like obvious, obvious, obvious. But we're going to make it even more obvious. Um. Bleg. But then stuff like this, they don't even elude. Oh, but the wall was destroyed, which means you can climb it. But it doesn't have the normal climbing texture, even. It doesn't even have the normal you can climb this texture, and it's just bleg. Why? Why can't they just design decent puzzles that are fun? But they can't. They have to make us suffer for no good goddamn reason. All right, now let's move the spinny, spinny, spinny spins into place. 
really wish I could just turn the fucking thing to see whatever I wanted, but nope, can't do that. That would be rude to the game. Free cameras. What's that? You don't you don't need freeform cameras. Nobody does. Durr. Friggin' faggin fuck I'm talking about ya. Friggin' fraggin. Finally. Give me time to look and see what's actually in there. Oh, hey! Those weren't there. Bleg! Just a bothersome, annoying, slow. That's all this is. Puzzles are a decent way to break up the pace of a game, but if it just brings it to a screeching halt, you have failed. You have failed, Darg. Can wish they put a little bit more thought into this. Because again, the only thing that I was missing was, oh, you can climb on the ceiling. And they didn't make that obvious in any shape, way, or form. They didn't even really allude to it. It's just broken walls. Now, if all the walls were covered in ice except for one, then I might have checked out the wall faster. But they didn't. There's just no illusion. There's nothing they did to make the game, make the player feel like, oh, this is a way I should go. And a lot of that is due to the stinking closed off camera. Because you can only dodge with the right stick instead of look around with the right stick. You are stuck into the game developer's wanton froze. It's like, if you can't turn the camera, it's up to the goddamn developer to tell you where to go with no confusion. And they failed so bad at this in this section. And in fact, a lot of things would be made a lot easier if I could just... Look around. I would have seen the body in the skeleton hanging area faster. Oh, yeah, and I can put my headphones back on. Bleg. Joy to the world. But at least now I know I can destroy these things. At least I should be able to, unless they want to change the rules again. There we go. <laughs> you game. This is bullshit. Oh. Still bullshit. Annoying. Frustrating. Stop. Oh, there's limits. Now all these dudes are gonna fire. Fucking one, fucking one. They didn't make that obvious either. Fuck you, game. Oh, and these dudes don't want to just start firing at me now. 
you know, like all the other times I've gotten, these guys have gotten in my way. Consistency. Once again, the obvious thing is, oh, turn the thingy. And then they says like, no, that's not the way you're supposed to do it. I'm like, yeah, sure. Now I see the remains of a ladder there. I didn't see it before because I was more focused on the thing immediately in the middle of the room. The subtleties of game design have been thwarted by this game. Not nearly as bad. Okay, fuck off. They did not show a second hive, but apparently there's a second hive, I guess. Okay, fuck you. They did not show it. So no, you don't get to say the grrr. The sec- the two, the one at the bottom, and then the one at the top, sure. Why can't I hit that one? There you go. Really? Wait. And now I'm gonna just make sure there isn't a third one that they I wasn't told about. Okay, no, good. I guess a fourth one, I should say. Because there was a third one I wasn't told about. But yeah, while this game is much better than the first in presentation, style, game design, everything, there, the little things really put me off. Once again, it still has trouble telling you where to go. That's an important part of game design. Subtly pushing the player in the proper direction. Making sure the player doesn't get lost or annoyed. Some of it is the player's fault where it's just like, Oh, why didn't you do this? It's super obvious. But then there are some things where it's obviously the designer's fault. 